What is up, you guys? Today, I'll be reviewing WWE Magazine July Edition. Alright, we got John Cena on the cover. The American flag in the background. Pretty nice. Uh, golden WWE logo. Stars and Stripes. John Cena. A patriotic salute to the USA. Pretty li I like this cover. It's good. Alright, so it includes two free posters. Alright, here are the posters, like always. Show you guys the posters before I start the review. And, uh, this is the whole, uh, it's pretty small this, this month. Let's see. 2013 WWE roster. And basically, all your main guys in the front. Your mid card in the middle. Except under here. I don't know why Taker's right there. And then mostly all your jobbers are in the back. Or something. I don't know why Sinkara and Rim are on the back. They're not jobbers. What the heck? Is, why is Joshi Tatsu right there? Makes no sense. But whatever. We turn it. We turn it over. We turn it over. And uh, you have double trouble. Bella twins. Yeah. Pretty pretty nice. So yeah. Close up. Alright, back. Alright, let's get started. When you open it up, there's a uh, Money in the Bank promo. Prom promo pick right there. Pretty nice. Looks like a legit poster. Alright, Brawl. We got um, Dolph Ziggler versus Kofi Kingston. April 29, 2013, Columbus, Ohio. Del Rio vs. Swagger, SmackDown. April 19, 2013. Triple H vs. Chris Jericho. Uh, fully loaded. July 23, 2000. Old pick. Old school. You got John Cena vs. Ryback, Extreme Rules by the Numbers. Dolph Ziggler. Uh, subscribe now. WWE Famous Force. Force. Superstar Mass. Parts Unknown. WWE Magazine 30th Anniversary Celebration from 1988 to 1998 to 2008. Journey of a Overnight Superstar. Overnight Star. Jerk of the Month is Antonio Zazaro. Don't know why. Really, I don't know why. Uh, the writings on the wall. This week is it's Caitlyn, yeah, Caitlyn. These are like cute little Q and A questions. I read you guys one question. Let's see. Oh, which this one? Which high school clique did you fall into, and would we ever see you deface public property by spray painting your name over it? Yeah. So it has her answer right there. I don't know. I can't. Pause. Can't read that. No, but I guess. It's a spray painting can right there. The Horseman of Horseman Ride in WWE. Uh, Scars of the Superstars. This one's Dean Ambrose. Round and round. The I think Randy Orton talking about uh, 12 rounds. And then a promo for ECW to uh, Chibugalo for ex the ECW uh, unreleased on two, of course. And then the promo for the DVD, the top 25 rivalries in wrestling history, which I have reviewed in my channel. And then the one word intervie interview. Where we go? No, you can't read that because my camera isn't that good, but it's better than the other one, you gotta admit. Right. This is from Ringside Collectibles, Figure Insider. 
We got Elite 22, 23, Series 31, Basic Series 32, Battle Packs 23, Battle Packs 24. And then we got Texas Rattlesnake, Stone Cold Steve Austin exclusive, Man Cactus Jack exclusive, Hardcore Can exclusive. And we got all the figures on the set right there. Use discount 10% off. To get 10% off, use this code SHIELD, or in Tim Grimm's Toy Show, use Grimm. And then you got the mic, a drawing of a uh, live back right there. And then the fan art of the month. Congrats, Caden S. And then the one body dumbbell workout. This month's Heath Slater. And then ask Biggie Langston questions. Yeah. Big E right there. Q and A. Then eat your way to a perfect six pack. Apples, almonds, twenty to twenty five medium sized nuts per one ounce per day. Berries, green, leafy greens, starchy vegetables, yogurt, salmon, turkey, eggs, and oatmeal. And it does like and it gives you like info like how Dolph I think Dolph Ziggler actually eats all this, I'm pretty sure. And then power of the punch. Avoid these fatty foods to do everything but whittle your waistline. Alright, so we got French fire French fries, high fructose corn syrup, processed cheese, white bread, <laughs> frozen meals and soda. Huh, it's weird. No burgers really? 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 Whatever. But yeah, knowledge of nutrition right there. Then Debo of the Month is Natalia. Uh, what? And then Shawn Michaels kind of looks like Natalia in that picture right there. And then July events in WWE right there. And then another Q&A question. Why? Q&A questions, but whatever. It's actually a good picture to get signed. I ain't gonna lie. And WWE quiz, of course, like always, the WWE quiz. I'll read you guys one. Let's see. Which of the following WrestleMania events did not take place in Ontario, Canada, at the prestigious WWE History Land Sky Dome? Triple H vs. Chris Jericho, Brock Lesnar vs. Kurt Angle, The Ultimate Warrior vs. Hulk Hogan, The Rock vs. Hogan. Hmm, don't know. Huh, interesting. I know that one. Alright. So, let's read the other one. In 1997, Bret Hart lost the WWE Championship, his home turf of the below Super Search, who was not directly involved in now infamous incident. Old Hebner, Mr. McMahon, Diesel, Shawn Michaels. Huh, I know that one. Number 10, the last one. Which of the following divas did Trish Stratus never defeat for one of her runs with the Women's Championship? Mickey James, Gail Kim, Jazz, or Lita? I know that one. And then, oh wait, and then the rating scale from local competitor, NXT rookie, tag team cha champion, intercontinental champion, WWE champion. Uh, why did they put local competitor? They used to put it as a jobber. And then we got the new WWE championship, spinning championship, heavyweight championship, tag, United States divas, million dollar. Uh, rated R, Undisputed, Smoking Skull, Attitude Era, and Intercontinental Era, 2012 belt. We're buying cane masks, accessories for the belts, figures, yeah. And we got America, WWE America, what does the USA mean to you? And then we got a picture of John Cena, wow. John Cena, WWE Champion, epitomizes the ideal that hard work and destination can be determine and will lead to fulfillment of the American dream. Then we got Jack Swagger and Zeb Coulter with an eagle. And then we got Damien Sandow right there. You're welcome. Then we got Caitlin. Wow. Kind of teasing out, but yeah, she's okay right there. We got Kofi Kingston. Wow. Little flag right there. Jerk. We got the Miz right there. Sporting his coat. Red, white, and blue. I mean blue. We got Zack Ryder with his red, white, and blue American flag shades. Tono Zaro. Yeah. 
We got uh, Heath Slater. Where, where's his red flag thing? Oh, there he, there it is. Pretty nothing much, but I guess. Tensai. Oh, Tensai got a small picture. Wow. And Mark Henry too, and he's supposed to be running for the world title this week. Oh, WWE got the U.S. Championship. Wow. Yeah. Tells you the history, like how he got the belt. Like we know that. So yeah. So yeah, I'm here. Ultimate WWE Superstar Road Trip. I don't know what happened. Uh, West Central, you had California, Bakersfield. Oh, this is actually kind of cool. It tells you information. Best clash of the titles nominee. Jericho versus Ryback. Mad Game of the Year nominee, uh, Triple H, Punk's Paul Heyman. Sheer Brutality nominee, um, Mark Kenley beats Seamus Silly. Biggest Terror Jerker nominee. Biggest Ferric Victory nominee. John Cena defeats the Shield. Rivalry that's far from over nominee the Shield versus the Undertaker. This could be a WrestleMania match. I can see it happening. And we got a uh, promo of a call right there. A man divided, and then like a Q and A with Mark Henry. Yeah. And it says, I went from being that troubled kid to doing something thing, something extraordinary, Mark Henry. Then War Games DVD promo. And then, before the bell, primetime players. Teddy Sonio and Darren Young. And then, uh, coming soon, 30th anniversary of WWE Magazine. And then, on sale July 23, 2012. SummerSlam goes Hollywood. Yeah. And the back. Pretty messed up back. Look at that back. But I don't care about the back, you know. Mostly I just care about the front if it's good. Like, see, the front's alright. So yeah, that has been my review. All right, so gotta edit everything out and stuff. So yeah, I have been Wrestling Machine 28, and this has been my review. Peace.